I always say the good Lord put me on this earth to be a singer, and I firmly believe that. But really, the only other talent that I had was playing sports, and baseball was, without a doubt, my um, the best sport for me to play. The the most successful that I was in any sport was baseball, and um, I really think about baseball. I think about my father. I, I think about music. I think about my father, and. Um, you know, it's just one of those things that when I grew up, you know, from four or five years old, if I wanted to hang out with my dad, it was usually either watching baseball at the house or I was walking to or from um, school with him. We lived right next to the high school. And so I would just tag along. And, and I still hear people today um, that were students of his then, they'll come up and they'll say, man, I never saw your dad, especially in the summertime, without you like five steps behind him. And um, and so I think just as a result of all of those memories and all of that time spent doing it, it was just something that was sort of ingrained in who I was. And um, and it's, it's funny because I feel like both of those things have run parallel to each other for most of my life. Um, I moved to Nashville to quote unquote play baseball but the reality of the situation was I was using baseball as a way to come to Nashville to see what Nashville was like. And um, and then as my career began to um, happen, so to speak, um, the the opportunities for me to, to, in essence, live out some of these baseball dreams. I mean, I've played in three celebrity softball games on major league fields. Um, I've gotten to go to spring training with the St. Louis Cardinals, which was my childhood team. And so it's just um, very ironic that leaving baseball and choosing to be a country music singer allowed me the opportunity to go back and live out all those fantasies and dreams of putting on a uniform and running out on the field with a bunch of major leaguers.